You can actually hear things even as I'm starting up this stream, but the countdown still exists so that I can at least test things out and then you can skip things, you can skip forward if you're watching this, you know, from a future date. But, as I make sure that I can actually see what's on screen, and also I need to make sure that I have the scoreboard prepared, because for some reason I don't have that prepared. Um, yeah, we're gonna flash that on screen really quickly, because just to make sure things are correct, they should be correct. And then I can go back, and then we will get this stream started. So... Without further ado, as we get into our first run, which will not be on a Halloween timeline, random timeline please, it'll be a Thotu ill-fated character specific Mizuki. Ill-fated at Thotu, eh? Um, hmm. Well, I've already done it though too, but obviously the point is to survive, so here's hoping I do. Let me look at what we have at the lighthouse. I think I'm actually going to level up here. I would like fame, but if I can't get it, well, leadership, funny enough, will be just as good. So, second encounter, eight dexterity, second mystery, Takshisan, light check, and maybe a strength check, but every single non-stat check, if I can even remember that, because I want to forget that. Want to, am, I, am I using that version of that word correctly? Anywho. Uh, let's make sure I don't ac accidentally skip forward, because this is important, and I am slowly dying to- or I am slowly reaching a higher score. I think this is as far as I've gone so far, which is sad to say, because I'd like to- I'd like to say the reminder slash disclaimer that is, this challenge really isn't as hard as I'm making it out to be. There is some RNG involved as we get mind drained, so we really shouldn't have any problems, but- we are nail faded and the though 2 does do a lot of damage to our face, so without further ado, I see Ward, I think. Recluse, Akamanto, Teacher, Vigil. Did I set the Illegal Den? Please tell me I set the Illegal Den. I should be setting the Illegal Den for the thingamajiggy, the... To do the ally attack strategy, especially since we have Akamanto and Recluse. We should have more than enough. This just happens to be a run that works out for me. Um... If I cannot succeed this run, it would be quite weird. So, what do I want to do first, actually? I think I want to do Teacher, actually, first. Although, if I get badly bleeding and recluse, that's just as bad as well. Mm. I'm thinking. <sighs> I may have to... I may have no choice, though. I mean, I do have a choice, but... I can swerve, kind of. If I take Teacher and suddenly get badly bleeding, I can grab a... I could go into Akamanto. Do I want to, though? I'll have to. If I knew what mystery... Okay, so this is why I usually wait for to see what mysteries I have. Is because if I leveled up here, then I would have known I could have... I had more Doom to spend. And I could have re-rolled once or twice for fame. But since that didn't happen, let's get in. I think I'm going to stick by what I'm doing here. We need to visit the schoolyard first. And one of them is increasing my charisma, so that will definitely help. But we do have a bit of a pro I think Recluse... No, we're not going to look for the ghost, uh, the ghost return Recluse. For some reason, I was thinking we were going to get more steps. We were not. So uh, Fujiko will help, certainly. But actually, I want... Iwa optimally, and that did not happen, so away we go. We'll hold on to prepare for the moment, but on top of that, Mansion Forest Max Threat Level, and I think it said Seaside High. So we have Teacher, Recluse, Akamanto, Vigil, and Ward. So I do want this... I do want this Hospital Pass. Yeah, especially since we have Ill-Fated. I know it sounds a little weird, but trust me. Despite starting at 30% Doom, it'll be well worth it. Uh, let's not visit the school nurse. That's a waste of Doom. Uh, Legal Den. Hospital Pass. And then we will... We don't... Yeah, we're not really visiting any other max threat level location. Are we? Vigil. Ward. Yeah, funny enough, we're not. Akamanto, we're in... 
I guess we'll see. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Because the only one I I don't remember for sure is uh, Nails. Uh, Nails? No, Teacher, which we're in right now. I think we have like a village investigation or two, but we're really not visiting the mansion otherwise. I might just want to eat this in the face, but since I want to take Recluse, I guess I'll just eat the Doom for now. Yeah, funny, I do want to visit the police station, because the handcuffs will... I will want them, but... I, I guess we'll... Let me just go through it in my head again. Hospital... or not hospital. Ward. Recluse doesn't matter. Akamanta, I guess we'll... yeah, we'll set the police station patrols to the school. Basically, we, we got a really... we got a really good run RNG-wise. It's just up to me to capitalize on it. I could have even gone for, have, have gone, well, now that the hospital's max threat level, I should have set the, actually, I'm just going to switch to the police station now, the doom is, the doom is going to hurt me. Unless it increases, unless the threat level increases again, but we'll see if we get the nurse event. Otherwise, we need to stick with this much reason. We don't have, I just realized we don't have a weapon, so if and when we go to the recluse, we're, we are going to be in a bit of trouble. So we really want fame. That's what I'm trying to say. We really want fame. Uh, I don't really want to roll on that. I may have no choice, though. Four stamina. We'll have to eat it in the face. Nope. I did not. Well, okay. We have Fujiko. That's right. And we're on a Thotu. That's why we're eating a lot more damage. So, yeah. Our Doom is going to shoot up through the roof. I I just realized that. I may need to Mind Drain. I do want to Mind Drain uh, in... Recluse, actually, so scratch that idea. So if we get a high roll here, we should be able to one-shot. Okay, and then we just need to hit the kick. Let me just put the sensor on screen just to be safe, which it is not on screen because I did a thing. So, I mean, it again, I don't really think this boss... No one's been censoring this boss. Only I have, so... Let's hope we don't get badly bleeding and we move on with life. So we eat four Doom, and then we eat four more Doom. I could use Mind Drain once here, but I want to do it in Recluse. As I said, we get badly bleeding here. So maybe I actually want to take Akamanto instead. There's time skip, by the way. So our Doom is looking really bad. We just happen to roll into bad RNG. Please give me fame. Oh my goodness, why would you not give me fame? So effectively, I have about... 54-ish percent doom. We could actually die here. Um, uh, we're gonna keep uh, keep taking charisma just to speed ourselves up here. If we get somewhat lucky, what we will be able to do is I'm gonna take recluse now. By the way, what we will be able to do is. Do a thing. I'm badly bleeding, but we should not... It's on a proc chance. If it were, say, cut artery, then I would be a bit more scared. But since we're not, we're just going to take the stamina damage. And again, depending on how lucky we... Okay, I just have to take this reason hit, by the way. My doom is increasing too much. Yeah, so events like that are kind of what we need. Because we're our doom is still very, very high right now. Now, granted... We are doing a lot better than we would have, because if we did not get the hospital pass, we might just end up dying to stamina anyway. So, away we go. Yeah, away we go. I think I get like two severed kicks. Yep. So, six damage and a lot of pain, because we're on a Thotu. But we're gonna Mind Drain, so it's fine. If we did not have Mind Drain... Occult Signs may have helped, but not that much. Uh, I'm just gonna be safe and do this, so let's go. Fetid Fumes doesn't really matter. We're on... Uh, it kind of matters. Oh, we, I still have these. Do I still have the sensor on screen? I do. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. But had to kind of focus. Uh, I could toss the vanity mirror at someone. I'm probably going to do that. But first we go into Akamanto to try and decrease our Doom. We will be able to level up immediately. 
But let us see what happens. Oh my goodness, are you really not gonna give me fame this run? Ugh. Well, I'm... <laughs> no, we're still taking this. I could double up on dexterity. Do I have a dexterity? Yeah, I have a dexterity check. I would like to do charisma, that would help as well, but... Let's get eight in dexterity. Uh, we need stamina, so we're actually gonna enter this. We're ill-fated, however, so we're just gonna take this reason damage for the moment. There's something I wanted to do. I guess I forgot. So, away we go. Uh... Reason. Reason. We need to take reason damage. This is gonna deal a lot of stamina damage to me. Hopefully I should be okay. Oh, that's right. I'm still badly bleeding, by the way. So I need- I do need to get rid of that. Might as well grab painkillers while we're here. And we'll treat this. We did not get discharge summary, but, you know, it, just as good. Uh, we need to pop these now, by the way. We'll use this. And we'll keep moving on. So, yeah. Effectively, we're at 66% doom. I didn't know I was going to get that. I would like a pack of cigarettes, but now I'm scared about my doom. I also still have the monument, but I don't want to use it yet. Although we do have Vigil. We're stuck in Vigil and Ward, so I actually do need to use it now. Ask for funds. Gosh dang it. Well, that's as good as we're going to give it. Because I think if I do anything else, we're going to be in a bit of trouble. So here's hoping. Again, this could be a lot worse of a run. However, you know what I forgot? I forgot my second encounter. Oh my goodness. I think it was actually the roommate, funny enough. Was it? No. I, f I must have fought something beforehand. I feel like I fought something beforehand. Now I'm scared. We'll worry about that when we get to the lighthouse. Anywho. So we do have a good chance of hitting both of these. Let me see what I can do. Hi, haven't been current. Much of a habit to catch one. S score looks good from the thumbnail. Yeah, this run is looking a lot worse. <laughs> Again, 70, uh, effectively we're at 66% dupe, so it's not it's not over yet. 95% though. Okay, good. We do get to one turn, this guy. And then we immediately equip the Crestfallen Mask. Didn't even need to throw the Vanity Mirror. So, 66% Doom. We're going into a very short ward, so that's actually okay. The question is if I can one-shot it, because I don't want to run from this boss now. And then we have Vigil. But we'll see. We'll see. If I get Dull Nurse, that this run, I should have no more problems with HP. But we'll see, because ill-fated. Ill-fated. So... I might need to one-shot this boss. I don't know if I can do that. Well, with Mind Drain, I can. The, qu uh, the question is, do I really want to? If my reason falls low enough, then the answer is probably going to be yes. Alternatively, though, fame would do really, really... Would do a lot for me. It, it, it really would. I do get a 100% chance right now. So let's use it. And we will level up soon. A pack of cigarettes would really help, but I don't want to spend any more doom at the moment. So, no... Oh, well, we're in, we're in downtown. Okay, yeah. We just happened to run into an encounter downtown. So my next question is, do I guarantee you with the vanity mirror or try a risk? No, I'm going to option select. So hopefully I... Okay, good. I almost messed that up. So what I was going to... I was going to mind drain if I did not defeat that and this enemy. It, it was kind of important. Give me fame, by the way. Okay, good. We're we're dumping our stats into charisma. So, away we go. So, HP-wise, we should be perfectly fine, aside from ill-fated shenanigans. But, we're not out of the woods. Oh, I just realized. We have Vigil and I have a max threat level of Mansion. Well. I should have set the... Oh, I, I was saying Vigil the whole time. And I proceeded to not think about... The fact that I had mansion investigations. Gosh dang it. Well, 
You know what the other funny thing is? The other funny thing is that I was I forgot I was gonna say because I'm just so flabbergasted at myself. This is gonna hurt a lot. My doom is gonna shoot through the roof. Oh, I really need to remember my second encounters now. <laughs> Uh, that and I need both doom decreasing events and not run into Rumu Ghost. If I run into Rumu Ghost, I could possibly die as well. I also need the weapon from here, so. <sighs> I can't really afford to lose an ally. I might have to, though. Yeah, I don't really have a choice. These do, t the other two options do too much damage to me. I lose reason for that, so never mind. I should have just taken the tattoo. <sighs> I didn't know I lose reason from that. I don't often play Mizuki as I do, so I guess that's uh, that's not great. But hey, we have Mind Drain, but it's that's it would have been better if we did anything else. So here's hoping I survive. I need to do this vigil correctly though. My doom is high, and it's gonna rise even more. So bow clap, bow bow. I'm gonna be really slow here. Bow bow, inspect, move on. I would also like to grab this meat cleaver before I run into any encounter, really, but... Do I have a curse, by the way? I do. Uh, that is gonna actually... I do want to cast Mind Drain, so let's actually get rid of that curse. But also so that we have space in our inventory. If we pick up Branded, then just... Uh, I mean, I had a lot of good RNG this run, but that's the one bad RNG I would not have wanted. So let's find out. Never plays Mizuki, so you're unfamiliar with their events? Yeah, me too. <laughs> we could just die to Ill-Fated here, by the way, if we don't run... Funny enough, now I do want to run into an encounter so I can heal Reason. But we'll see. So far, the game's been giving me okay events. Uh, the other unfortunate part is that I need to do a thing. Uh, I'm going to throw this Vanity Mirror just to guarantee this encounter. I'm pretty sure I... Yeah, now I definitely get out... But I did do 28 damage, so didn't need to do that, but hey, I should have used Mind Drain. I forgot to use Mind Drain. I was supposed to use Mind Drain. I was supposed to use Mind Drain. That's a mistake that could cost me. That I might be in trouble. I might be in trouble. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. I can't run into an encounter. I'll force myself into hiding. Woo! Quick thinking. One of the best perks in the game, generally wise, but still one of the best perks of the game. Alright, cool. I just need to... I don't even need to remember my second encounter, I don't think. So we should be perfectly fine here. Again, if I were any if I were any better at World of Horror, this should not... Like, this challenge should have been done in half the amount of episodes. Heck, I, I say if someone were to really stream this series and they knew how to play World of Horror, it shouldn't take you more than four or five streams, really. Unless you just get bad RNG and getting dupe gods. That's a rule I've imposed on myself, but... I really should not die here. I really shouldn't. I think, actually, the boss of nails is... But even if I fail the second encounter check, I should be fine. So I have 8 dexterity. I have most more than enough HP to survive. I have Takshi-san, but he should go down quickly. Do we have the 6th floor, by the way? No, we don't even have the 6th floor, so... Well, let's do the math now. So if, if for no one else, then myself, but for you at home. So I take 5 Doom here. Let's assume I fail this. I know Recluse is my second... Uh, mystery. So I have 89% Doom. I'm going up 5 floors, so that's 94% Doom. Takshi Sun should die in one, or should go down in one turn. I lose 3 reason here, but I have more than enough reason to survive. I can even Mind Drain if I want to. And I have 8, st I have eight Dexterity, so I should be perfectly fine. I didn't really put that math... I didn't really um, structure my math in a very organized way, but you, you kind of see where why I believe I should be able to survive. I mean, might as well just grab that. I, funny enough, do want to just take reason damage here, but let's find out. Let's just start climbing. We shouldn't die, is what I'm trying to say. So. I, I really, okay, I think it was actually, was it the Gore Covered Student? I feel like I fought something before the Gore Covered Student, and I did, so never mind. We should survive no matter what. We should survive no matter what. Like, it, it's near impossible for me to die unless I, like, meditate five times and purposely oof myself. But, you know. In-game. 
I'm gonna be really, really safe when I say this should be all 100%. Yeah, and Takshi. Well, I'm gonna drink this bottle of water and throw the empty bottle and throw everything I have. I'm just gonna throw everything I have. I could probably meet Cleaver like eight times. I don't care. I'm just gonna play it safe. Also, keeping in mind that I think, yeah, we're on a throw too. So this is a dupe god, by the way. So I didn't get anything from this run, although what I get is that I don't get reset. So into the next run I go. Which will be Yo Gothag, Curious Birthmark, Character Exclusive. I'm checking my scoreboard. Kyrie. And Yo Gothag is a new god, by the way. So Yo Gothag, Curious Birthmark. Character specific Kyrie. We do have a knowledge check, so 8 Charisma, 2nd Encounter, 8 Knowledge, Light, Takshi, and maybe a 2nd Mystery check. But really, I really need to remember my 2nd Encounter because it can, it can get really close. Or am I going to get or am I gonna get doomed by the fact that I take a Cold Shop and I regret it? Well, we'll see. If I get Ward, then it's worth it. If not, I, I hope whatever knowledge weapon I pick up is good. I didn't get anything from the Jar. That's bad RNG already. Well, that's not great RNG. You can work with it. It's perfectly fine. But as we put on our, our occult witch outfit for knowledge things, I see Flood, by the way. Flood, Coma, Hell, Arms, and Mermaids. So, in the interest of... So, again, a really quick tip. If, you were, if, you're, if you're, you know, newer and you're watching the channel now, I'm taking... I'm probably going to take Hell first, just so that if Rhodes Closed appears, I don't lose a lot of Doom. Because in Coma, Mermaids, and Arms, you're not really investigating other locations that are affected by the Roads Closed Town effect, which increases your Doom by 1 on top of whatever Doom is increasing by at base for investigating the Village, Forest, and Mansion locations, right? So, but I'm going to take Hell first so that I can at least grab a weapon. I know I have Doom to spare because we have Flood. In Flood, your Doom shouldn't really increase that much. If you're going for every researcher, that's up to your that's your prerogative. Am I using that word correctly? Native English speaker, by the way, but we do have ancestral Oh, I should have cast I should have cast ancestral strength before the run started. What this does allow me to do is that if I get the small candle, it will help out it will help out uh, for better or worse, I got the Ritual Dagger instead, so we'll deal with it. But I should have cast, so the reason why you want to cast Ancestral Strength before you even do anything, like, you, like when the run starts and you see what spell you have as Kyrie, if it's something you can cast like Ancestral Strength and you're not on Ath, maybe, then you can use it so that you can take a bath and heal. So I should be at 11 reason right now. Also, we have we do have Yogatag, but I don't really care about that. So... We're actually going to take this so we can level up faster. Yeah, my luck decreases, but most of the time it doesn't matter. So we'll take two reason damage and then we put the dust, dust in our nose. The corpse dust that drops from a ghost enemy. Don't, don't hurt me, robots. But anywho. Let me see. Prerogative, yeah. Prerogative is a word I don't use often. I try to use, yeah, funny enough, even though I'm also a self-proclaimed writer, also I haven't gotten any work done on my thingy magic. Hold on, let me focus, actually. <laughs> Hospital, Hospital Seaside. Hospital Seaside, we have Coma. We have Coma, actually. That should be, well, we also have, no, Mermaids doesn't take me there. No, only if it's Sailors. So let's just... I want to grab this now, just in case there's anything really weird happening. But we will set the police patrols to the hospital. Um, We'll hold on to ancestral strength as another quick curator tip. Unless you really need the reason, obviously use common logic. Because there are other situations to do things. But in general, until you get self-therapy as curie and you're on character-specific perks. Nice knowledge roll, by the way. You shouldn't forget your spells, like I could forget a spell right now, but if I get self-therapy later on, then I've lost reason healing, is, uh, if that makes any sense. Anywho. Um, I don't know if this is guaranteed. 13 damage. If he doesn't drain HP, I think this is. Yeah, if he doesn't drain HP, 
If it does, then what I'm gonna do is trade some stam- Oh no, wait, I get bonus damage. Never mind, he goes down. I should be doing 14 HP here. Yeah. Because it's 6 times 2, but we get 1 damage from something. I forgot what it was, a perk. I forgot. Ancestral Strength. And then the other point, the second point is from the bonus damage. From being weak to, I assume, magic, I guess? Yeah, magic. I don't remember what you do here. But we're just going to eat that in the face, I guess. Maybe going to take Flood next. Depends if I get to level up. If I level up into second sight, that will be just as good. But we'll see. We have Doom to work with with Flood, but... Yeah, the Pillar Vampire is quite... Well, in-game for me, when I'm talking about terrifying, I mean in the way that... Uh, has a lot more HP than most enemies, but... Maybe it's maybe that's actually average, but I don't feel like it is. Okay, now we have Book of Gore, so we should be... I mean... Aside from an immediate broken jaw or a cut artery into broken jaw, we should be okay HP-wise. What we're not going to be okay in is Doom, because that is steadily increasing. But at the same time, you... If our injury... If we get like three tiny cuts in a row, I could theoretically Book of Gore Monument. So, uh, three times. So, I want to take... Maybe I do arms into flood. Yeah, I'm gonna do arms into flood just to hold out. And maybe I see if I can get another level, another level up. But we'll see. So yeah, we do have arms, but we do yeah we do downtown into six apartment investigation. So yeah, I think I've made the correct choice in police patrols until I get a hospital. There's like their hospital has innate hospital events that increase your threat level. So. We're not taking reason damage here, by the way. That event, I would normally consider taking the right option, if my, especially if my charisma isn't high. But if, ooh, um, did I have d quick thinking is okay here too? But I do have a knowledge. Yeah, I have a knowledge check. Never mind. So we're gonna do knowledge strength. Anywho, I'm going crazy. I I forgot what I was talking about because I'm trying to focus too. But let me see. Watching. Content streams legit makes me play more and get more achievements. It's super long since you played, it feels like. Yeah, so, I mean, if you follow some of my advice, which I think I've said more than a few points of advice that are helpful, and you're not playing on Harbinger, you should just smash the game out of the park. Like, it's... Uh, yeah, um, and, and that's a good thing, I think, because you do want to... I think playing on non-Harbinger to learn the game isn't a bad idea. Nice SDE counter, by the way. That way you can learn the events and then imp and then uh, use that knowledge when you start playing on Harbinger. If you ever start to play. Again, you're not forced to play the game on Harbinger in any way, so... Yeah, yeah, gotten way better. Keeping certain things in mind. Oh, yeah, so... I know I'm not the best. It's not me being humble. I know <laughs> I've made a lot of mistakes, so I know what I am and what I am not. But... I think, uh, you know, I think I'm a good enough player to give some, uh, especially if it's objective pieces of advice, because math is math. Like, I, I can at least rely on that, but hey. We are on timeline B, by the way, so... Do we get out? 10, 20... We should. We take 6 stamina damage for it. Don't give me a bad curse, by the way. That's all I asked for, and that's okay. Perception, really, I don't really care. Unless I roll a 6 on trying to grab the katana, but that's... That's something else entirely. Um, out of curiosity, what is this thing's weakness? I really should... If I don't continue Event of the Day, which I really should continue, I should start logging weaknesses. But this should defeat the encounter unless a bug happens. Weak against? I don't know. Apparently it has no weakness. <laughs> Apparently it has no weakness. Oh, that's right. And then the Ritual Dagger has... Uh, a chance at proccing reason healing. I completely forgot about that because I don't often see it. Into Flood I go, though, and we do get a thingy. What was I going to say? Something. Forgot. Anywho, moving on. Now, you know what I also would have liked? I would have also liked to level up into Second Sight for this mystery, but... Hey. So, into the school we go. Never play that mystery, I assume, arms... On timeline B, he's so scary. Yeah, it's scary for me. It's scary in the way that again, it's a tank. It's a thirty plus HP enemy. Well, I think it's like twenty eight on 
No, no, 28. Yeah, it would be 28, I think, on the first mystery. But basically, it has a lot of HP, and it does quite a lot of stamina if you can't brace on the thingy. I, I should not have done this, by the way. Yeah, I shouldn't have done this. So, do we get out and thing? No, I have to take a risk. Oof. I have Book of Gore. I don't want to use it, though. Okay, good. We get Fungal Growth. That doesn't really matter until you stack, like, six... Cur okay, two... Though I might complain about RNG, and we're gonna rest till the end here, pretty much all we can do, or all we need to do. Yeah, as much as I complain about RNG, I've never been in a situation where I've taken so many max stamina, max reason hits from curses and injuries for it to matter. And if it did, it's probably because I probably cast, like, Mind Drain or something, so... Hey. So we lose, like, 10 reason-ish... Fungal growth is kind of affecting me here, actually, because I did think so. I should have taken... I, I I made a mistake. I should have taken the... I should have discarded fungal growth before I started resting, but... Not much I can do about it now. I can forget the thing. I also have Book of Gore. That's another Hallucinations, but that's fine for the moment. Cut one of my streams because 2.30 had the bright idea to wake up to it. Yeah, yeah. So... For anyone wondering, the reason why I mainly stream at this time is because it happens to catch most of my audience. But let me know if there's any other time that might be that might work out, and let me see what I can do here. Ooh, you know, if I believed in the coin flip, this, but I don't. So what we're instead going to do is trade a bunch of stamina. Six stamina. How much do I really want to trade? Not that much. Because I still want to be able to do Desperate Action next turn. Even though I, I'm going to get out anyway, but let's not hurt ourselves too much. And let's not make a mistake like accidentally pray and die. But you get what I mean. This should be an out. And away we go. Uh, that doesn't matter. Give me Second Sight or something. Okay, good. And I should maybe heal the reason, but I'm going to keep taking... Strength, because strength. Live in Japan as per the... Yeah, they're not really good to... Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, that makes that makes sense. Okay, <laughs> noted. Um, do I want to... Yeah, I want to take Mermaids first so I can get rid of Burns. Keep in mind, our Doom is actually really good right now. 46% Doom. But again, I usually play safe with Doom unless I'm going to grab a pack of cigarettes, but that usually is self-explanatory. Cigarettes in this game, if you're using it to, like get through the rest of your run, and you have the doom to do so, I say do it. But otherwise, I, otherwise I'm very not liberal on doom. So yeah. I do, I am kind of autopiloting through Kyrie events because I don't remember them at all. I, I really don't. <laughs> and even then, like, uh, yeah, when I'm playing as Miku and Haru, I kind of just make muscle memory decisions anyway, like if mus uh, if Miku's working as a maid, sometimes I just go back to the investigation to save on Doom, sometimes I do otherwise, hold on. Do I just want to run here? I just want to run here. Yeah, I want to run here. This is not great. But our Doom is steadily increasing, so we don't want to run too much. But hey, I also have Book of Gore. I shouldn't have just run away there, but hey. So, if I can... No, we want to take Burns. Burns is probably better. Yeah, Burns is better. If we have School Nurse, because I can notice the face and that increases Doom by 4, or I can take Burns and vis visit the School Nurse for 3 Doom. Or alternatively, go to the... the doctor's office, but I may or may not... Well, never mind. Now that I have... Now that I've gotten locked out, gotten locked out of my bath, I think what we're going to do is... I'm going to keep increasing strength, by the way, but hey. And then for Haru's events, I mainly just pick, like, go for the gun, because that you either fail and, I think, lose some stamina, or you get Haru's pretty much best-in-slot weapon in the game. So, uh, so I was gonna, I said I was going to visit this. Let's do so. Get rid of burns. And then sell the painkillers, because that does more for me number-wise than anything else. So, hopefully we get out of this mystery soon. The substitute teacher so... Deeply scary looking to me, always jump scares. I have no comment. I <laughs> This is one of the few times I have no comment. I mean, it's scary because I know I'm forced to roll the check, but 
Immersion-wise, I think what scared me the most the first time I played World of Horror was actually the... What did I want to say? The... Not the opening the school door, the window event. I forgot what it's called, but I think you know what I'm talking about. Nice 12 roll on perception, by the way. It's great that I have two hallucinations, and I should be sad about... Oh no. Oh, I have only four perception. Roll 12. Anywho. If I don't have Fetid Fumes, I should actually rest here. Yeah, I should actually rest to make use of my Doom. I did forget my second encounter, so I don't want to rest too much, but... We'll rest just enough to survive. Hopefully. And you know what? I don't have any real... I could have gotten rid of Fungal Growth with the old coin. I think I'm actually going to sell it now. We'll run from any hospital encounter we run into. We should still have enough Doom here, but... If things allow like that, if the game allows, I will just complete the run and move on with my life. I forgot my second encounter again. I I really I really need to not do that. I need to not not track. I need to track what my second encounter is. Anyway, uh, two reason we fast this. We don't have a light source, so all five reason we're taking all five reason damage. But that's perfect because we run to Takshisan with three reason, which means I can desperate struggle immediately. A very tactical loss of reason, even though I didn't mean for it. Second encounter, I forgot. I think we have the sixth floor as well. No, we don't. Never mind. We can just go up this lighthouse. And away we go. Yeah, away we go. If I somehow die, then I've made serious errors, but until that moment, we should be perfectly fine. It wasn't the vent crawler. That I know for sure. It might actually be one of these two. I'm gonna try to logic it through my mysteries because I don't actually I don't even remember which mysteries I took first. I took Flood third. That's that I know for sure. I think Toilet Girl Ghost was uh, Toilet Girls. Toilet Ghost was first. Why am I forgetting? I did. Oh yeah, I did Household Hell first. And I think I fought the Pillar Vampire. But then I took Arms after. Pillar Vampire? Yeah, it was Pillar Vampire. So, yeah. Because, yeah, Toilet Ghost was first. Because I did a school investigation immediately. I logic that out because my third mystery was Flood. And I know I didn't fight the Toilet Ghost there. The second mystery was Arms. And Arms there has no school investigations. So, therefore, I must have fought the Toilet Ghost before then. Which was the one school investigation in uh, Household Hell. I think... I could have been wrong. I could be wrong, but I got the I got the check right, so I don't really care as much. Anywho, uh, I can desperate action immediately. Does that get me anything? One, two, buh. One, two, three, buh. I think it should, right? Yeah, it does. If I hit both of those. So, hey, you got that run down, and I think I have two old gods left. Of course, again, with the rules of this challenge, I do have to roll into it. So as I show you my current scoreboard, if I can do this, we have a Zektast run and a Herald run. Both actually not. I hate Zektast runs the most. Azal right up there with it, but we don't. We did an Azal run. And third would either have to be Herald or possibly, well, actually, no, there's a lot of old gods that tie there, so. Here's hoping I get either Zektast or Herald so that at least to get a chance to update my score, otherwise, Maybe I get an Eldritch Parasite Kathak run and I start hating myself. So, hey, let's find out as we get into Ath Ill-Fated All Perks Toshiaki. You know what would be a not fun way to die, and I know I'm going to jinx it by saying this, but it would be to accidentally get Frostbite in my second investigation or something like that. But anywho, Strength, Knowledge, Takshisan, Dexterity, Second Encounter, and Second Mystery. The unfortunate part is that we are on Ill-Fated, so if I do get sucked into an otherworldly event that I need to roll on to avoid, I can't avoid it. So, Frostbite is immediate death. But that's a real Toshiaki worry, because in my opinion, I think Toshiaki is in a pretty good spot meta-wise. So, let's find out what happens to us today. Nothing in the drawer again, because why would the game ever give me something when I need it? Or I definitely just want it. Let's be serious. Okay, so not that bad, but a bottle of water does give around five to six stamina per run if you keep bath. As I see, ramen, scissors, 
Household Hell, Kana, and Metamorphosis. That's so we're gonna go. I ooh. Kana, Scissors, Metamorphosis. I know I shouldn't, but we're Toshiaki. Never mind. So we're taking Kana first. <laughs> uh, grab the book strap. We do have Scissors, and we are Toshiaki, so we can we can afford to be a bit liberal with our Doom spending. As pl if playing as a certain custom character meant anything. Now, I what I really should do is re-roll again until I get something worth the heck, but... Do I want to do shovel gaming here? I should actually have leveled up first. I'll re-roll two more times. Oh my goodness. Did I just get the same exact loadout? Oh my goodness. Well, we're going to grab the monkey wrench finally. Random item, right? Either way, we get a lot of damage. It's well worth it, in my opinion. And we didn't get anything else. So, what do we have again, mystery-wise? Oh, why did I forget this? Scissors, Metamorphosis, Ramen, and something. I'll take Running Shoes, though. Just in case. I mean, every location has bad encounters, so... Now, the downside to wearing the Monkey Wrench is that on Ill Fated, I could immediate. I could have immediately. I could have immediately avoided Frostbite shenanigans, but I think only one event is really, yeah, really forces you. It would force me into an otherworldly event. So, as we finally get our Doom to pretty much effectively zero percent, we want to take Doom choices. Now we spent an extra nine to twelve percent Doom. Grabbing a monkey wrench, but as I said, I think, in my opinion, it's worth it. So, I'm pretty sure these bur burnt notes don't uh, are, don't actually count towards the book strap as well. I feel like I've said that before, but I keep forgetting. But anywho, yeah, now we're effectively at 7% doom, finally. You can actually, yeah, the right, I think the right option is a strength check there, but if you can avoid any bad things happening, I don't, I say why not, right? Anywho, let's be sure. So yeah, it only yeah the the burnt notes burnt notes do not count. I don't think I get anything from this though. Yeah, I would have to roll on. You know what? Theoretically speaking, the number is in the numbers are in my favor, and I do get bonus damage. So uh, probably gonna take around three doom on average. Never mind two doom, but on average about three doom. Eighty five percent here though. Good. That's the one I definitely need to hit. And we'll take Kana with us, because otherwise, we're eating a lot of- That just happened to be the investigation where I was missing Kana, by the way, so... Ouch, but hey. So our Doom is supposed to decrease by 8? Was it supposed to be- is- love, I forget. It's been a while since I played Toshiaki, although I still like playing as Toshiaki. Okay, never mind. Our Doom decreases by 10. I thought it was 8, maybe he was rebuffed, or maybe that's a bug. We do get roads closed, so... Do I need to worry about that? Let's find out. Because I forgot. Household Hell? Okay, yeah, we do kind of need to worry about that. But we're Toshiaki, so at the same time, it doesn't matter either. You know what? I would like another book item so that we don't have to deal with this hot garbage. And I'm pretty sure the Friend's Diary doesn't count. Fishing Square? If it does, I mean, we're Toshiaki. It really shouldn't matter as much, but hey. Uh, we do want to do this right. The Cursed Scissors would be interesting to grab as Toshiaki, but if I spent money on the Monkey Wrench, I mean, uh, maybe. But I don't want to... We we can we can survive just fine with what we have, so it's called Part Guest, but... And I wasn't scared because of... Jump Scare, it was just the... I don't know, something about uh, bumps on the face. But anywho. 90%, 12, 2 stamina, but that's fine for now. So let's just get our two turn and leave. And see what we get. What did I even gr Oh, that's right. We're on all perks. I was like, where are my Necronomicon pages? That's right. Um, Daddy's Girl is okay. Hot Bath, if I'm Toshiaki. You know what? Yeah, Hot Bath. And then let's avoid dying to Frostbite. And away we go. Uh, We're on Ill-Fated. I can't remember which is which. So I guess we'll take 20 experience and a curse. Oh no, my spells cost doom. Oh, whatever shall I do? It, it's still worth it. If you need to cast something like Book of Gore, I'd say you still cast it. But anywho. 
Uh, yeah, we, we, I mean, we can take this now. Do I want to? If it's Upper Kingdom, I guess I would trade Reason for Stamina. Yeah, you know what? Let's go in. Uh, trade Reason for Stamina, as I just said, so that our HP stays at a constant value. Otherwise, I would be wasting numbers. Because my Reason, I would have not been able to heal one extra Reason. And away we go. Yeah, with that extra point in strength, we can now do Prep Attack, Prep Attack with the Monkey Wrench. Because, man, uh, that's a heck of a thing. Uh, we'll Brace here to be safe, though. Or to save on one reason. Otherwise, I would just eat this in the face and then just proceed to... Desperate struggle. But we don't need to because we get out anyway, so... I could have also just thrown the wooden bat, but... I think the wooden bat is worth more than minus one all. That's what I would have saved. And we lost bat, but... We have hot bath now, so... If need be... We can try to do a thing. So it will help because we have Metamorphosis right now, so... <laughs> uh, yeah. So Metamorphosis... Ramen... Okay, so we have, we're have we gonna set the police station to downtown. If we didn't already. For some reason I didn't set it yet, I guess we will now. I could also go for a pack of cigarettes, but let's hold off on that for the moment. We shouldn't need it. And we'll do things. Oh, we also have Seaside. That's right. Never mind. I should have sent the police station to the Seaside, but... Uh, we It's still worth it, but... I've kind of made the choice already, so... I think it's still good number-wise, but I'm Toshiaki. I like... I shouldn't be this loose with the score that I have, but hey... Also, isn't this an Ath run? It is, so... I just need to survive the run. Well, <laughs> just need to survive is the operative phrase here, but... Give me Fast Swimmer. No. Fame. Uh, I mean, uh, funny enough, I'm probably just going to take Fame. I'm going to rest now, actually, though, because... I don't like being at 3 Reason. Uh, and now we're forced to enter the thing, because we're on Ill-Fated, so I might as well hear Reason why I'm doing it. Uh, we fail no matter what, but I'd rather lose stamina and then rest so that I can top myself off some more. And we keep moving with life. Effectively, we're at 38, uh, no, 28% doom, sorry. If we are, if our doom is increasing by, or decreasing by 10 at the end of every mystery, well, actually, we'd be at 32%. But you get the point, we have a lot more doom to work with, so. Uh, nothing else to grab, we just fight this thing as topped off as we are, and then we probably just rest again. We have Kana with us. In fact, I can even, I may even do this. Now, I'm probably, no, I'm not going to go, I'm not going to do that. So we're going to take, we're going to take minus four all and get out of this encounter. Because that's what's going to happen. Now, I swear this, this encounter is bugged in some way because I've taken more damage than I expected before. But, anywho, as we get time skip and move on with life, because that doesn't mean much. We're Toshiaki. Uh, we lost bath, but we're Toshiaki, so into household hell we go. Right before we enter the mansion, we will rest just to make use of our doom. I could also trade a bunch of experience, but because we're on all perks, maybe it works out. We'll see. So one seaside investigation, and then there's going to be a mansion investigation, but I get to rest here, so one... Two. Because I'm on ill fate, I'm just going to take the rest now while I have the efficiency. But then I should really stop after a point because... Yeah, my doom is steadily increasing. I know I'm Toshiaki, but still. want to be safe. We effectively have 54% doom. We definitely have less doom now, but... Just play it safe. Play it safe. And play it safe. So... Also, we have three knowledge, so my monkey wrench was really not going to do much for Sever, but hey. Uh, lose more reason. Lose more doom for the moment. Grab a mask, which would be cool. But keep moving on. Again, if I die here, it would be mostly my fault. So yeah, effectively, we're at 63% doom. Uh, we do get to level up. Give me something. Uh, doomed already? Yeah, doomed already. 
take more strength, move on. I forgot my second encounter, so... I need to not do that. <laughs> Gosh dang it, man. Uh, I can run from this as well. Can I do anything better? Kind of. I think I can do this. Yeah, I can. So we're going to do this in the interest of not dying. I'll also, I might as well just throw the wooden bat here. If we run into Miku, uh, I guess we run into Miku, but we'll take three reason damage and do this encounter. Because then I can throw the ritual mask. Which did not get, to, which I did not get to proc, but hey. Hey. So we'll move on. I was going to say something, but the math didn't work out as much as I expected in my head, so we're going to instead move on. So 66% doom right now. Yeah, we should be okay no matter what. Uh, we also have the... No, well, back to max threat level downtown, but nothing I can do about that. Um, Take the stamina hit for experience. Keep moving on. We should still be okay here. We're definitely still okay here. Do I want to lose minus two all? Yes. So, no, I didn't mean to do that. What the heck? Why is that saved like that? Gosh dang it. <laughs> uh, um, so we have a lot more doom to work with actually. So let's just actually rest twice here before we move on. We'll be at around 80% doom when we end this mystery. So yeah. And we should be perfectly fine. Nothing should cause us to die. So as we grab the last key and then move to the lighthouse. I don't remember my second encounter at all. But it shouldn't matter because we don't even have six floors. So we have Takshi-san but uh, Takshi-san is also going to go down really quickly. So just to be safe we'll rest twice and move on. Yeah, and we should be perfectly fine. I'm only making sure I have enough stamina to survive because I wasn't sure if we had every single stamina checked. I really should have checked, though. Should have checked. But anywho, one, two, three. Well, one, two, this. Handcuffs. Uh, I could, I would have been able to level up, but hey. Yeah, so we did run into every single stamina check, by the way, and then we got absolutely nothing for our level ups. Yeah, we got hot bath. Yeah, never mind, we got hot bath. We also had running shoes, so we got to run away for less doom. But let's try to remember this. I think Glitch Magician was first, because I complained about it. I don't remember who was next, actually, because I don't even, even remember my second mystery. So, uh, I'm going to say it was Drain Swimmer. Okay, that was right. And yeah, we'll move on with the score that we have. No change in the score because we already did Ath. So let's just get into our next run. And I will see uh, Azal World of Horror Character Exclusive Jury. So for better or worse, we did Azal already. So this is another duplicate god. Charisma, Knowledge... Takshi-san, second encounter, second mystery, and maybe a strength check. And we'll see what we can do. So... We're jury on Azal. And this is pretty much no nothing else. That's just all there is in the run. What do I want to do exactly, though? I think I'm just going to go with the hardware store again. We're going to use the checkbook once or twice. Preferably only once, but if I can't help it... Can't help it. But what are our mysteries like? Household Hell, Footage, Flood, Nails, Vigil. I can do Vigil first. Do I want to do Vigil first? What is the main reason for me to use Checkbook? It is so that I can grab a weapon. But if I can grab the Meat Cleaver, then it doesn't really matter as much. Now, my worry is that 1. We have Azal, and 2. We have Footage Hell, so if we get roads closed... I mean, we have Vigil anyway, so... The, essentially, this is a very bad roads closed run. If I get it after my first or even second mystery. Nice 12 roll on luck, by the way. I really appreciate it, but... We'll move on. 
Preferably, I want to not run into it. If the game is going to hand me Azal and maybe even the experience rule early, then I need. Then all I ask is that I don't run into an encounter until I get the meat cleaver. Although if I run into Rumor Ghost and possibly the whole Rin thing, I'm not going to do. I'm not going to fight either of them. So we do grab the meat cleaver. We're not on random item stats, right? Nope. So we take RNG if we're going for two attacks. Oh, sorry. I so I'm sorry. I forgot about you, Puppet Matron. I'm sorry. Puppet Matron is included in that. 95-85. And we take minus two all, but compared to other encounters I can run from... Also, I just missed my 95%, by the way, but... We shouldn't miss any more. Four all for this isn't the worst. It's pretty bad number-wise still, but what else am I going to do, right? So anywho, we're going to burn this book and move on. Even if I were Tosh Toshiaki, I think I would have burned it anyway. Uh, although you should be taking it because it's a book that can be used for the bookstrap. But as we trade Reason for Stamina here, in a very particular fashion... We're going to lose more reason and then move on with life. Yeah, we should be okay with Jury here for now. But Azal can change that because as soon as we get the experience rule, I'm going to hate myself. Although, Jury, funny enough, because it works on experience, that means that the most that Jury can lose, unless you're storing experience because maybe a weird calculation happened, um, you won't be losing a lot to the experience rule. So basically, Jury should have less of an issue with Azal. If for no other reason as I get nothing but generic perks, then her experience cap is a lot lower. Now, if I get Mind Wipe into Azal, I'll just keep Mind Wipe on me, but we'll see. Footage, Flood, Nails. So I'm probably going to do... No, we have to do Nails, Flood. <laughs> we have to do Nails Flood because pain. Because I definitely want to take Flood before the fourth mystery, but I also want to get rid of all my bosses. So, boss mysteries. So, plus two Doom. We're going to keep moving on. I could grab a pack of cigarettes. We'll be in Flood, but still. Yeah, we'll see. I think I can do this. Hold on, let me look at my threat levels. Seaside, forest. I'm gonna. I probably. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do forest. This is forest because we have, we have a forest mystery and we have possibly forest investigations and flood because I'm only gonna grab the theologist. So, hey, the unfortunate part is that I, I am using the meat cleaver, so my attacks are all not guaranteed. But until. Until I absolutely need all of the reason, I should still be okay. So let's just take the stamina damage for now. I think I hand... Yeah, I handcuffed this boss. Because there's no other reliable human enemy, aside from maybe Takshisan, but Takshisan is usually a non-issue. And I will be able to level up again. So let's see what happens. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm on character-specific perks anyway, so... Uh, can't really brace into anything, can I? 70% meat cleaver. Yeah, you know what? Let's just go for it. Um, do I get to do this close? Uh, I want to guarantee... Let's guarantee this. The handcuff use. And let's move on. I had an item in my inventory, so my doom increased, but it's... That's not the worst thing in the world, and I think my second encounter was the Kabuki Killer? So... Otherwise, I'm gonna kind of be sad, but... We keep increasing our knowledge here. Now, if I see quick thinking, I'm gonna double up on Dexterity, because double flashbacks is something I am worried about. <laughs> so, um... Yeah, let's not, let's, not, let's not let that happen. But anywho... Need to remember the store of the long pig steak before I fight the boss. We reliably two turn this guy. And we'll see what else happens in Flood. Preferably, as always, I want the Theologist to be in the school location. But if not, it shouldn't be that bad. 
We could try to go for an extra re- Never mind, we're lighting the candles. And we are moving on with life. The Theologist was in the forest, so max threat level forest patrols was a good call. Uh, I know I said I was going to take quick thinking, but I'd rather take two dexterity and an extra point into strength. For a little bit of doom, but it's, a, it's only a little bit of doom, so hey. And depending on how hurt I get here... I will, I may want, I may pick up an extra researcher. Preferably from the school, because that will allow me to rest as much as possible. So, I made the choice though, once you go in on researchers, I suggest you, ooh, resist, that stamina. I suggest you commit to it, because otherwise you get uneven rest. Now, Time Warper is not great, but... We get to meet Cleaver three times in a turn at 95%. There's no reason why I should feel too threatened. And I think we get to... We we don't get to heal top ourselves off, I think, but... We should have a good boss encounter here. If not... Pain. So... I know I have the long pig steak again, but I'm at 28% doom moving into my fourth mystery. Give me something. Give me that much, alright? Okay, that's a really good turn, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take that and run with it. 85% <laughs> to deal extra damage to the boss. And we're not gonna take any more RNG. I think that's all I'm gonna get. So we take four reason damage, and I think we get to desperate action. Unless we start missing a whole bunch, but Okay, well, I mean, if the game wants to do that, then we'll play. We'll play ball. So trade four stamina for two reason. And I think... No, we are not out yet. So, do a guaranteed brace. I think this is guaranteed. Uh, this is guaranteed. I lose an extra point of reason for it, but we get to dust spread struggle this turn. And we do at least 13 damage. Uh, I have the long pig stake and I think an energy, so that's why our doom increased. But again, we're on 31% doom on our fourth mystery. I think we're doing well, even less now that we've taken elusive. But I should have checked my lighthouse because if we have the knowledge check, it would have been good to put a point into knowledge. We do have a knowledge check. We also have a strength check and we have the second encounter, which I said was something. It wasn't the puppet patron. But hey. Uh, household Hell and Footage. I'd rather take Footage. Two for each spell learned. We don't have any spells, so hey. I might as well just store... Uh, no, you know what? We're gonna sell this and grab a pack of cigarettes. In fact, I feel so confident right now that I'm even gonna do... So we could turn this into a horrorless run, but the most important part that of me playing right now is the fact that I am... The fact that I'm doing a Nuzlocke, so I don't care about the horror catching up, I just care about surviving. So I should be able to smoke the, both these cigarettes reliably. We do have Nicotine Rush. Now, you know what, Leia, let's get rid of that. Well, it's less being confident than me crunching the numbers, it, or what I just said. So I don't care about the horror catching up uh, when, I'm, when, I have, when I'm under the effect of Nicotine Rush, is what I'm trying to say. Although, when I roll 12s, when I roll 12s. Also, I am going to be stuck in this forest for a while, so. Paid. But anywho. Um, we don't get amazing turns, but. 85, 75, I should come out on top. Unless I just miss four things in a row. Are we on some. Oh, no, that was Hasty Aid. Are you serious right now? <laughs> Gosh dang it. Anywho. Uh, we should be able to do this. We will get to level up one more time, but the horror is likely going to catch up. So, you know, level six as jury is pretty okay. Now, we are slowly dying here. So, let us see what we do. Oh, no, actually we healed knowledge. We healed knowledge here. Uh, but we do rest, because otherwise we're going to die to reason, possibly. 
In fact, I might want to even rest some more, but let's find out. Yeah, we're going to be stuck in the forest. I'm going to rest again. I think I two-turned this guy, reliably. And now we barely get to Brace Prep Strong, which is good enough for me. It's good enough for me. We definitely get to Prep Attack, Prep Attack, but... The most important meal of the day is fighting things Jury's way, so... Uh, yeah, we're gonna let the Horde catch up here, because I don't want to die to reason, so... Okay. Now our Doom is steadily increasing, but I think we've spent all of our Doom somewhat efficiently, at least, so... Let's find out if we survive. As long as the game doesn't roll 10s, 11s, and 12s for the next six events, we should be perfectly fine. Is my luck high, by the way? It isn't. But we rolled a 9 anyway, so... Unless we I built into luck, which we have no reason to at the moment. We weren't going to get much out of that anyway. Uh, do we get anything more? We, these are guaranteed. I should just be doing this for, an ex, for extra damage. I think we get out in... Okay, well, we get out in three turns, definitely. Can I do anything better? 5-5-7. Five, five, I don't want to throw the brick at this thing. But it is minus all. Yeah. I'm going to brace again. I am slowly dying, by the way. But... Again, this would be really unlucky. It would be really unlucky. Okay, good. Crip Blood Moon, but... Well, that is that does hurt me, actually. Because uh, I'm pretty much able to 100% everything. If we didn't have Blood Moon, we would be able to 100% everything. Also, our Doom increased by 7 because I forgot about Azal. <sighs> no, not like this. Anywho. We're still okay. We're definitely still okay. But I need to not do what I'm doing to myself. And we also need to get out of this mansion quickly. But we'll see, right? I should have enough cigarettes for... The lighthouse as well, in case Takushi-san exists there. But events are rolling as events are, so... Pain. Nine strength. Oh my sweet goodness. Well, now we need to rest. Am I gonna die here, by the way? Hmm. I'm not gonna say I didn't need the cigarettes. But things are happening on screen. Yeah, there's not really much else I can... Hey, why is that event appearing all the time now? Anywho. Because I think I can react and store my brick at the end of the mystery. Two smoke bricks in a row? Oh my goodness. Well, the RNG is turning around slowly. And let's store this brick and not eat a bunch of doom to the face. We will get some doom increase, but... Really could have done a lot better here. So, hey, there's that. Although we should survive no matter what, HP wise. Doom wise, we're not. I'm not sure yet. So we do have both second checks, and we have Takshi Sun. We pass the knowledge check, and we pass, or we fail the other one, but it doesn't really matter. So even if I forget everything, I should be okay. Unless Takshi Sun smacks me good in the face, but. We don't even have the 6th floor, so we should be okay. I think this is a dupe run. Yeah, they were on Azal, so this was a dupe run. Anywho, we brace here to be safe, I think. Yeah, we brace here to be safe. And if I miss every single one of these 90%, one of them is guaranteed, but you get what I mean. If I miss all the 90% here, I would be sad. Otherwise, yeah, this should be a guarantee. No, 90%. <gasps> I should have thrown the brick. Our cigarettes did perfectly do the thing, though. Ooh, I forgot. <laughs> uh, now I don't remember. Um, I think I took Household Hell first. That I know for sure. And I did run into the Puppet Matron first as well. I took Flood third. I'm pretty sure I took Flood third. No, I fought Metamorphosis. So... I took Flood second, I believe. Which means it would have been the sweatiest soup. <laughs> now I don't remember. <laughs> um, What am I doing with my life? Vigil, I was thinking of another run. 
No, I took Flood third then, because then I did Nails. Ooh, so it, Nails was second. Nails was second. Okay, good. <laughs> uh, almost messed that up. But thankfully, the game gave me my first three mysteries, so... Uh, anywho, the scoreboard hasn't changed, so but I'll, I'll this time I'll show it to you as we get closer. As we get farther in our stream here, and I, and I know I just popped the screen on, on screen, but, you know, for clarity, eh? And let's get into my next run. Again, With now that you saw that, I think we need either Zektast or Herald, and we got Goizo. So Goizo, Medical History, Character Specific, Ayaka. Um, I guess we just discard this immediately. There's no other reason to have it. Until we get a character that works off of status cards, but hey. Strength 8, Light Check, Second Mystery, Dexterity, Charisma, Second Encounter, which I never remember, but... We're Aika, so it should matter a little less. Kind of. That's not true, but you know what I mean. We set a Legal Den because we can run Aika with kicks, and we hope that we don't get double flashbacks when we visit the... Tree. Because we want all the curses in the world. Curses have become more dangerous in this update, but not dangerous enough where you wouldn't want to take curses. Basically, you still want to take curses as Aika, in my opinion, anyway. Although I don't play Aika much, so painting, scissors, arms, bulletin, and ward. Well, that's a doozy of a lineup, but we can avoid painting. Arms is 50 50. Scissors is also 50 50. Bulletin and ward, so. What do I want to do? I'm going to take Bulletin first so I can get these curses on my face. There's there's our first flashbacks, by the way. So we're going to poof this away with the power of the necklace. But we're also going to take two more curses and trade it for funds. Uh, Blood Frenzy is not great, but we'll visit the History Club once and take Blood Mania. And all is forgiven, kind of. Kind of. We're not out of the woods yet. So, let's start moving on. I will visit the monument once, but we do want to move on. Uh, police station, because we have downtown. I immediately know that. Or maybe not, but let's let's just be a little safe here. But yes, with Aika, you just want to just eat all the curses in the world. Although if I level up, I'm probably going to immediately take Dexterity if I don't see Quick Thinking, because... Double dipping into flashbacks is not what you want to see. You like it 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 can happen. It's a non-zero chance. Other than that, yeah, no other no other double stacking of curses will kill you when you get two curses immediately. Two hunger, two hallucinations won't kill me. Hence why I say when I'm leveling up, I'm probably if I don't see Eldritch Possession, which will be the other one I'm looking for, uh, I'm gonna increase dexterity. So yeah. I'm in Bulletin, by the way. I should be visiting the forest so I don't fight this phone. Or slash Bulletin. But yeah, let's find out, shall we? I also realized I didn't do a thing and I should be watching something, but... It's fine. Nothing bad happened in real life. So, away we go. Uh, we should be able to brace into four damage kicks, question mark? Five damage kicks, sorry. But hopefully things go... Okay, so here's a, very, there's a very kick moment for me. I really need to hit kick... No, we're just going to guarantee it. We're just going to guarantee it. Who am I kidding? Who am I kidding? So we get to do... This should be guaranteed like at least 10 damage. So yeah, 14 damage on demand if I do Desperate Struggle. So away we go. To reason, I did I not okay. I did do it. I, I got really scared for a moment. Uh, I because I think I do die to this phone. If oh, that's right. I have blood. Uh, I have blood frenzy. That's why I'm taking a lot more damage. But after after a while, I should be able to just one shot everything. So it should be fine. Now my doom is steadily increasing, but I haven't run to my second encounter yet. Um, and as promised, I'm going to increase my dexterity because I did not get Eldritch Possession, so. Drink this bottle of water, fill it up with water, take Reason. We're probably going to take Scissors now. Insomnia Cursed Signs. That's fine for the moment. 
We're on timeline B. Clap for bows. Not F O R, F O U R. And we'll move away. We'll move on. Uh I don't want to take reason damage here, but there are more than a few things. Yeah, so. Boohoo, Ayaka has three luck, but I rolled an eight, so. Hey. And let me trade stamina for reason. Yeah, clap for bows. That's the order in which I'm doing things, and we should be able to, like, near one shot this guy. Now, if I miss two kicks here, I'm gonna cry, but you really shouldn't. Alright, kick should turn out for the best. There's only going to be one bad moment, but as long as you guess that one bad moment correctly, or it's not your life is not on the line most of the time, then you can afford to have kicks fail on you. But optimally, you want to reach a point where you you can defeat most enemies with two kicks. So hey, clap for bows. I guess that phrase is how I'm remembering. So even though I said oh you are, I'm really remembering it by F O R. But clap, bow, clap, bow, clap, uh, bow, sorry. So clap, bow, clap, bow, bow. Hopefully I remember that. I actually just forgot what, oh, I think it's the bloated teacher. Bloated teacher is my second encounter. Yeah, bloated teacher is my second encounter. Bloated teacher is your second encounter, Jordan. Uh, do I want to enter painting with, no, I want to enter ward. Yeah, I want to enter ward. Get rid of this boss. There's the, there's, uh, flashbacks, by the way. Survivor's guilt. But we can carry these flashbacks with us until the end of the run. Or we can run into Dulners and do uh, some other fun stuff. So, uh, I'm not going to fill up my inventory. I shouldn't need it as Ayaka, but we're definitely going to sit here and improv for a moment. Uh, not in real life, in game. So that we don't experience a tragedy. But I do want to leave inventory space because I do also want to pick up this... I mean, I think I get to one turn the boss guaranteed, so... I mean, I can check right now. Yeah, I can one turn the boss. With the handcuffs, anyway. So, let's make sure I actually do the handcuffs correctly. And, yeah, well, I'll sit here for a moment. I have Actually, you know what the funny thing is, is I kind of sit here in autopilot for a moment. Blow the teacher is my second encounter. Remember, Jordan? Is that... I do have a lot... I did have a lot of... You know, whenever I'm not streaming, I come up with things to... I, things that I could talk about and want to talk about on stream that would either would be interesting or just something to say that would, you know, be good for me to say on stream. But I often forget because I'm also concentrating, you know, you know, I am on this channel. For those who don't know, I often am just more focused on the gameplay. So I end up commentating over the gameplay and what at least what I'm thinking of. Because Dead Air is, doesn't really make for, well, unless... That's part of your charm, but Dead Air doesn't often make for good videos and certainly less likely to be good for your stream. But, you know, I'm not saying nothing's impossible. I'm just saying in general, yeah. I I did come up with ideas, but, and I do often write them down when I have, when I can, but in the Nuzlocke challenge where I'm currently at, I think I just want to be safe and, you know, just do what I'm doing. So... Uh, I shouldn't really do that. I shouldn't do that. Because <laughs> if I miss all four kicks, as unlikely as it is to happen, it feels really bad, as it turns out. So, hey. Uh, we don't have Eldritch Possession yet. I should have actually leveled up before that. Oh, we didn't get anything. Never mind. Uh, we're going to double up on Dexterity again. Because double flashbacks will kill me. And I want to keep as many curses as possible as Ayaka. Meanwhile, I think we can do- can we take this encounter, by the way? I think we can. Kind of. Yeah, the answer is yes. Because I throw this wooden bat and all is right with the world. Uh, and then we move on. We get the package, but I also want to take everything else out from my inventory. Buy a coffee because we have the funds. Handcuffs, empty bottle, medical kit, just in case I get a really, a really weird injury. Because I'm pretty sure I can one-shot this boss. Now, I, I'm pretty sure I can also guarantee a kill without handcuffs, but... Let's hold off on that for a moment. Uh, 
uh, we'll take both of these. Actually, I should equip. Well, I should equip a branch and then take two broken bottles. Unless I, yeah, I have nothing but branches. But you get the point. I can also throw the branch without bugging out my inventory. Uh, or I could just one shot. So yeah, so yeah, that's what I just talked about it. I know I'm a little late in the street. Well. Uh, my latency is kind of late, so I reacting to comments is a bit slow, but I pretty much said that near the same time, I think. So yeah, that's why I have the branch equipped and I took up two broken bottles. So that my inventory should not bug out. Nice immediate downtown encounter, but I one-tap you as well. If I can avoid using the handcuffs, I might as well. Better to keep it in case another... There's a second flashbacks, by the way, but... Um, things. You know what? I'm actually going to forget that flashbacks with the power of the necklace. Because I shouldn't need it. And away we go. Now, my doom is steadily increasing, by the way, because I also am keeping branded on me. But right now, flashbacks was the most, was the scariest thing. I also, did I just get four flashbacks total in this run? Anywho. Um, and I should be able to, yeah, I should be able to one-tap this boss without... Using the handcuffs. And prep attack, prep attack is pretty much the same as double... I mean, it's not, but you get what I mean. You can only guarantee really three kicks in a turn. So hey. Although the third kick is at 90%, so I really shouldn't need to worry about that either, but... Yeah, not getting Eldritch Possession is doing a heck of a thing for me, uh, against me, but hey. I would rather take painting now... Although I could die to reason. I don't know if I have the choice, though. So let's actually get rid of Branded, because that is doing a lot against me. I think it's still going to do more than Survivor's Guilt. Survivor's Guilt is the one I should have gotten rid of early, but I needed the curses to survive. And let's use Quick Thinking, because we have Quick Thinking. Uh, Doom Effigy, I guess I might as well, but... Like, uh, I could actually die to double hallucinations as well, so let's hope. Also, yes, I do have Blood Mania on me, but I really shouldn't need to worry about that. I can one-tap everything reliably. Except for Rumu Ghost. If we run to Rumu Ghost, <laughs> we're probably going to run, but we'll see. Because I think I can brace into a substantial sever turn. Hold on. Ah, my face. Okay. So I think I have this saved up. 24 damage on demand. We got a black lock of hair, but that doesn't really do anything. I'm probably not going to be able to handcuff anything. I could probably even fight this boss. And I think I want to, so that I'm not doing as many mansion investigations. And if nothing else, we grab Amy so that we can at least send Amy towards an enemy if I need the extra damage. So, here's hoping we get to burn the book. And we move on. Again, you don't have to burn the book every time there. If for some reason you think you're going to get a good book, I guess, uh, then yeah, you do what you, you do. What you do. So, uh, I'm not going to roll on that. Although, we get really close. But, okay, the chance of missing two kicks is really, really low. It's really low. Oh my sweet goodness. Kicks suck, man! <laughs> it's not the end of the run, but oh my goodness. Ah. Ah. My goodness, man. Why is it like this? Also, now we can die to uh, double flashbacks again because we, we just happened to get coughing blood. But we also have a medical kit somewhere, I think. I don't think I sold it, so... That's fine for now, but I could have also done this. But I think my odds were better doing nine, three 90% kicks into an 80% kick as opposed to just an 80% kick. But, I mean, like... How much did my Doom decrease? I think Doom Effigy is still... It's, it's not as much as I would normally hope, but... Anywho... Moving on. I hate the kick action, man. <laughs> we do have a medical kit, by the way. So I think coughing blood is um, a minor injury. Yeah, it is. 
So let's do this. And um, get rid of the double flashbacks shenanigans. So. <sighs> I think I drank my bottle of water, right? So. Uh, let's move on with life. I could also use the handcuffs, but I pretty much one shot everything. Panic, masochistic. So those both are fine. I mean, panic's gonna. Actually, let's get rid of panic. Again, since I pretty much one-shot everything now, I should definitely one- If you're at the end of the game and you don't one-shot things, I mean, yeah, you maybe wanted to get rid of the five flashbacks you took, but... Normally, you should be able to one-shot everything. I also should have rested. This should- Oh, that's- that's reason. I- No, not like this! Not like this, please! Not like this! Oh, I forgot this event. No. But I thought the right option is reason loss anyway. Am I wrong about that? Anywho. Let's just check to see if I can't forget anything so I don't lose reason. Or I don't, uh, so I can possibly heal reason? No, I can't, can I? Well, I, I died as I lived, forgetting things, so, um... I should have rested. I really should have rested. I didn't catch myself at three reason. I don't know why I'd... Well, this, I wouldn't have been in this situation if I had hit every single gosh dang kick, but this is ultimately my fault. Um, I don't think I have any way out. No, I don't. Uh, if I have paranoia- Do I have paranoia? I just happen to not have paranoia the one time getting rid of an ally would help me here, really? <sighs> yeah, I'm pretty sure there's no way out. Nope. Um, that's not great. No, not like this. Not like this. Come on, man. Uh. <laughs> Well, um, yeah, with this said... <sighs> no! So the rest of the stream is gonna be, uh, I'm a bit depressed to go on, but... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 is my current high score. But as I show you the reset scoreboard, um... What we're gonna do for the rest of the stream is figure out, see what would have happened if I got Harold and Zektast, so I can win some sort of moral victory, even though it's not really a moral victory. But anywho, also I did that for some reason. But yeah, that's gonna be the rest. So I'm gonna do two quick runs, well, quick quote unquote quick runs, and we're going to see if I would have completed the run if I gotten both Zektast and. Herald quick, but I'm gonna hit quick play just so I can re uh, roll things exquisite. Oh, let me actually write this down so we can kind of do this as legit as possible, even though this is kind of more a bonus round at this point, but Mizuki. Ooh, exquisite taste Mizuki. Ugh, that sounds like a bad time, but again, we're here for the thing now. Actually, uh, yeah, we're just gonna assume I get Zektast first, so we're gonna do the Zektast run immediately. And also, off to the side, yes, I have been working on the fanfic, but I didn't work on it at all yesterday, so I'm still at 2200 words. <laughs> but Exquisite Taste, uh, Random Item, Harbinger... Something else? I think there was something else? No. All perks, all perks, so... Um, Alpert Zektast. Oh, yeah, that looks really bad, by the way. So, how would I play this run? S strength, second, second light, charisma, toxic. Yeah, I'm just... I think I have to play this consistent. Not with ally attack, is what I'm saying. So, it's going to be schoolyard. Hardware shop. And then we tree for funds. Yeah, we tree for funds. Uh, we do use the library notes, and then we lost the library notes, but hey. Uh, put on some clothes, and then we see. I mean, yeah, this is not true, because if I had completed the run, I would be on a different backstory co uh, character combination with Quick Play, but again, we're humoring the thought, so. Footage, Vigil, Kana, Botanist, Metamorphosis. So let's do this. Again, we're going through quickly just to do things. And let us see here. So, um, as I just said, we tree twice. We get flashbacks immediately. We get panicked immediately. But just going to have to deal with it. 
Um, funny enough, I think I actually take the shovel here. Doing extra damage and a little faster, but ultimately we're just gonna swing for the fences. And we want to move as soon as possible. We die at 63% doom because of flashbacks, unless I get rid of flashbacks, but we'll see. If I level up into quick thinking, my idea is that I'm gonna double up on dexterity. And we'll see what happens. We do want to take Kana. We have Metamorphosis third-ish. So let's see what happens. But yeah, I would not, I would personally not try. If you have exquisite taste, you can still go for ally attack, but if you're on Zektast, it all changes because you are not guaranteed to be able to get good turns. Now, if you get fame immediately somehow, maybe it's a, it, it's a bit more workable, but normally if you have bad luck and your doom keeps increasing, you'll reach a state where you'll have like five charisma or six charisma and your ally attacks are really not worth it because you'll only get about 12 to 14 damage a turn. Assuming you get really lucky. But if you get really lucky, like again, like I have Kana and then I picked up another ally from an event on top of having Mizuki's passive ally, then sure, you would be able to do 14 to 16 damage guaranteed. But uh, the point is that Zektas is slowly wearing you down. And if you can't rely on Zektas, again, you can just get completely lucky. You can get Charisma, Strength, and then whatever else other stats you need. And then you can just pick up a bunch of allies. Like, a whole bunch of good things can happen, but... When a bunch of bad things happen, it I in my experience, it's normally bad. Again, the rest of this stream has turned into kind of a... A, uh, what do I, what do I want to say? Also, I should look for the ghost ritual here. I'm actually going to pull things up because I... Again, we're not doing the... We're not doing the <laughs> Nuzlocke. This is not the Nuzlocke. This is a theoretical Nuzlocke. If I had a bit more power as well. So five claps as a want. I mean, you could do five bows, but the 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 algorithm is the same. So three ritual moves into a clap, 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 bow. Okay, I did get that right. I would have gotten that right. After this step, though, I'm not sure. So one ritual move. So you switch over to... You do kind of a sandwich, which I don't know. But okay, clap, bow, bow, clap, clap. And then you slowly move the bows to the right, I believe. But it was clap, bow, clap, bow, bow, clap, clap. And we move on. So, deduction, so we can level up quicker. But we'll take dexterity for now. Uh, set the police, the police station downtown, by the way. And we will uh, see if the shovel works out for us. Again, we're losing one to all stats, but... It's not that bad yet, because all you're really doing with the shovel most of the time is prep strong. Which is normally not enough, but with 7 base damage it could be... I think it is actually worth it. It's heck... It's a, to, in, my, to my, in my opinion, it's a heck of a lot more worth it than going for 3 steak knife attacks. Again, I, I swear I don't have a complete vendetta against steak knife and fast weapons, but it, I mean, I wouldn't really argue if someone accused me of it, because I've... I really do like to dunk on fast weapons that do 3 damage. But anywho. So we get our deduction bonus, but it doesn't really matter because all my stats are continuing to fall at the moment. Uh, metamorphosis, because metamorphosis... Ooh, that's right. Metamorphosis, so... Uh, we'll see. Well, there's my plus 3 strength, as I said. Am I just using up all of the rest of my luck that I would have had on my next Nuzlocke attempt? Anywho. Yeah, I mean, who ha who really has a good encounter against these guys, but still at the same time? So we do get to... well, it's not great, but really? That's reason there? Why is it... I should be... T oh no, what? Nah, ah, anywho. Um, I don't think this is guaranteed... oh, no, it is guaranteed. Because this is 13 damage? 15 damage? 14 damage. Anywho. Now, it's unfortunate I lost a boatload of reason, but hey. Uh, you know what? Actually, no, we take reason here, because we could die. We could still die, but... I'm hoping I get... I'm hoping I lose stamina so I can rest a bit more comfortably, but maybe that doesn't happen. Maybe that doesn't happen. Maybe that doesn't happen. 
I can forget Void as well, so I'm actually sitting on a bunch more reason, but... Oh boy, 30%? Oh, that's not great. I'm just gonna take my two reason hit to the face. And in this turn, I am going to kick, but not before I use up six stamina, so... Hey. And then I'll rest. Once, at least. Uh, I won't be able to level up yet, and we did get extra charisma. So, yeah. How did I, Why did I... Maybe I shouldn't be doing these runs, because I'm, I'm using up all my luck, but hey. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. It Will it be fine? I don't know if it'll be fine. Anywho, moving on. I should be able to, like, three-turn this guy, right? Yeah, I do. For minus four all, but you know what? It's metamorphosis. It's metamorphosis. So away we go. We get funds from our shovel, which I do like to use for Nicotine Rush, if we even get the chance, but Zektast is our worry here. Vigil Botanist. Ugh. Yeah, this would have been a really bad Roads Closed run. But hey. I mean, on Zektast, you're trying to not spend Doom anyway, in fear of zero statting. Even as base characters, zero statting is a real danger. Although my reason is particularly low right now. Oh, I didn't even do the vigil. Well, never mind. Throw that out the window. <laughs> um, oh, we don't get anything guaranteed here, so we might as, well, might as well just take the two turn. I know we can desperate action, but we just take the two turn. Um, Force tapes do nothing. We have random item stats, so let's see if this meat cleaver is good. It is... Eh. So we'll move on. We've already failed the vigil as well. So we might as well just store the pamphlet, actually. And we move on. Oh no, Spooky is gone. Ah, my face. Uh, Doom right now. I know our Doom is going to continue increasing through the roof, but... Maybe... Oh uh, no, we two turn. No, uh, no, we do. We I think we can do better. Yeah, we can do better. Now there is an all enemy that is. Uh, there is a guest with an all enemy right now, but uh, discipline, take dexterity to not die, and now our dexterity should be perfectly fine. But we got a Zictast event, so the game is just like, haha, idiot. That's what you get for increasing your dexterity. Also, am I dead here, by the way? 85%. Okay, good. We got a lot of experience for our trouble, but I don't know if it was worth the doom increase. We are on our last mystery, so hey, there's roads closed, though, so never mind. I throw everything I just set out the window. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Well, it looks like we'll survive the run, though. It looks like it. Again, I'm not going to guarantee anything because the run ain't over, but as my face continues hurting. Uh, can we do anything else substantial here? No, not really. We can't do anything here. We can run, but I don't want to run, so I guess we'll take three stamina to the face and see what happens. See what else happens. Yeah, see what else happens. Because we have Discipline and Doomed already. If that doesn't mitigate a lot of the pain that it can be in, I can also cast Void right now, but that... Nah. We get a free event. That's as good as I'm going to get on Harbinger. Is that the second Charisma increase I've seen? Anywho, Fast Remember or Fame? I don't even... I don't... I can't even tell, but... Which I should be taking, but I'm gonna just going to take... I'm just going to take Fame and Hope. And away we go. I mean, I am using the... The thingamajiggy, the the shovel. So I don't know how much I'm really going to get, but if we reach the lighthouse, we should be okay. If not, yeah, the shovel is always going to be the shovel. <laughs> um, It would be nice to hit both of these. Do we? We do. Yeah, I, I sneezed, but... Yeah, let's just get out. We can't even desperate. Can we even desperate struggle? No. So maybe fast swimmer was the thing to do, but 
I mean, fame is probably going to provide... I, maybe... I, does fame provide more? I'm I'm not in the mood to think, so away we go. I think we may have also had a ghost at some point, and I knew the ritual, but I didn't do anything, so... Uh, if nothing else, since my mind is going away on this video... Uh, on the stream... And I know it's going because I said video, and when I supposed to, when I was, when I wanted to say stream, yeah, I think we'll end the Nuzlocke here. So, uh, yeah, I was already reset. This is not a real run, so I was just gonna figure out. So the, I'm gonna put out a video either today or tomorrow, if tomorrow isn't just a fan fiction audiobook. But uh, it's going to be a Herald run, and we're gonna see if I would have survived. But I mean, we're not out of this run yet. But it, 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 this run is pretty much near over. So. One, two, three. I can kind of just walk up this lighthouse and not care as much. So, yeah, let's just walk up. And we should be okay. Unless we just die to stamina. But I guess we'll find out, right? Yeah, I'm not in the mood to think. <laughs> Kana, I think I did Vigil a second. Nope, I'm going crazy. Uh, we do have a light source. Not that I needed to use it. Uh, we have 9 Charisma. We have Takshisan here, but he should kind of just collapse under the weight of... Mizuki. Although I will go for... I'll, I will go for Broke. Nope, we didn't get it. And yeah, that's a Zik Tass run down. So yeah, without further ado, I mean, I can show you the scoreboard, but I mean, we are reset. So the run I just did was more part of a different timeline if I had rolled different gods. And I think that's interesting to look at, but hey, the challenge is the challenge. So without further ado, yeah, not really much else to say. I'm going to probably be working on the fanfic later for the rest of this day that I have in front of me. And if you have anything you want to say, you know, you know where to reach me. But otherwise, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. That would help me out the most right now. I do have memberships open if you want to do that as well. But otherwise, yeah, not much else to say. A lot to do this coming week as I, as, well, it seems to, it sounds like I always am. But without further ado, I'd like to thank you for watching and I will see you when I see you. Remember, I think the next stream is going to, stream is going to be on Friday. But videos all throughout the week. That's what I decided for myself. So, yeah, one last time, thank you for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye, my poor score. My poor scoreboard, please!